Portugal, which is situated on the western coast of the Iberian Peninsula, is one of Europe's most popular tourist destinations due to its pleasant temperature, low travel expenses, and diverse attractions. The diversified terrain of Portugal stretches from the beautiful mountains and wineries of the north to the glitzy beaches of the Algarve on the southern coast. The Azores and Madeira archipelagos, both part of Portugal but located in the Atlantic Ocean, are famed for their lush scenery and flower gardens. Here, we are presenting you the top locations to visit in Portugal. Coimbra. Coimbra, a lovely city on the Mondego River, is home to an abundance of ancient attractions and a vibrant culture focused on one of Europe's oldest colleges. One of the finest things to do in Coimbra is to get lost and discover the city's numerous ancient sites, which range from the magnificent old cathedral to the Gothic monastery of Santa Clara of Velha. It holds Queen Isabel's tomb. A visit to Coimbra would be incomplete without paying homage to the University of Coimbra, one of the most gorgeous libraries in the world. Number 9. Azores The Azores archipelago is made up of nine volcanic islands right in the Atlantic Ocean, approximately 930 miles west of Lisbon. Each island, renowned for its world-class whale viewing, hot mineral springs, and attractive seaside communities, which has its own distinct personality. São Miguel is the biggest of the Azores and is labeled the Green Island, while Pico is home to Portugal's highest peak. Number 8. Aveiro Aveiro, which embraces Portugal's Atlantic coast in central Portugal, is known as Portugal's Venice for its attractive environment of stunning watercourses connected by lovely bridges and populated with colorful gondolas. Aveiro is a famous tourist destination because of its historic attractions, beautiful beaches, and delicious cuisine. The Aveiro Cathedral, the So Goncalino Chapel, and the Convento de Jesus are among the city's many tourist attractions. All of these places have beautiful architecture and artwork. Number 7. Evora Evora is a tiny town in southern Portugal, yet it has a lot to offer tourists. Evora, with a history spanning more than 2,000 years, was once a prosperous city under Roman domination. Evora now has 4,000 historic sites, including ancient Roman fortifications and temples. Another attraction is Evora's 13th century cathedral, one of the most prominent Gothic monuments in Portugal. Not far from the city's trans, Europe's biggest prehistoric megalithic complex, which is well worth a visit. Number 6. Porto Porto, northern Portugal's bustling metropolis, is world famous for its production of exquisite port wine. It sprawls over the hills surrounding the Douro River. The lovely pedestrian zone, the Ribeira, is located in the center of Porto. It is an evocative spot on the river, teeming with live music, cafes, restaurants, and street sellers. The Ponte Dom Luiz, a metal dual arch bridge that connects Porto to Villa Nova de Gaia, a town famous for its port wine cellars, dominates this popular tourist destination. Number 5. Madeira Madeira, called the Floating Garden of the Atlantic, is a magnificent oasis between Portugal and North Africa on the Atlantic Ocean. Known for its beautiful green sceneries, flower gardens, and wines, the Orchid Garden and the Laura Silva Forest, which is the world's biggest concentration of laurel, are the must-see attractions in Madeira. Funchal, Madeira's capital and largest city, is home to medieval churches and fortifications, as well as the tree-lined Lido Promenade, which offers breathtaking ocean views. Number 4. Sintra Sintra is a magnificent location of grassy hills studded with charming castles and palaces nestled in the foothills of the Sintra Mountains on the Lisbon coast. 
Penna's Palace is the most renowned and magnificent castle evocative of Germany's Neuschwanstein. time. Penna's Palace, built in the mid-19th century as a summer home for the Portuguese royal family, is surrounded by woodland portlands filled with exotic plants and flowers. Additionally, the old remains of the Moorish castle atop the city's tallest hill, as well as a lovely Montserrat Palace with its subtropical gardens, are not to be missed. Number 3. Obidos Obidos, located on a mountain top in western Portugal's central region, is surrounded by an ancient defensive wall. Apart from the wall, Obidos' primary attractions are the spectacular medieval castle and historic town, both of which are readily walkable. A maze of small cobblestone lanes leads tourists through bustling squares, charming shops and whitewashed cottages, feastoned with vibrant flowers. The castle with its towering architecture, massive gates and towers has been transformed into a magnificent hotel, yet it remains a wonder to see. Number 2. Algarve The Algarve's sunny Mediterranean environment, stunning beaches, attractive towns, delectable cuisine, and inexpensive prices are just some of the reasons it is one of the most popular tourist destinations in Portugal. The Algarve, located in the country's southernmost section, is a visual feast ranging from serene panoramas of olive orchards and quaint whitewashed villages to wild, windswept landscapes. With its magnificent cliffs filled with summer resorts, the shoreline is a sight to see. Faro is a region's capital, whereas Lagos is the area's nightlife hotspot. Number 1. Lisbon Portugal's capital and largest city, extending along the banks of the Tagus River near the Atlantic Ocean, climbs upward amid seven high hills, producing an appealing destination of vibrant districts resonating with traditional fado music. Alfama is the city's oldest section, a former Moorish quarter notable for its labyrinth of cobblestone lanes, rustic architecture, and St. George Castle. The greatest way to discover Lisbon is via tram, particularly the well-known Tram 28, which runs through ancient areas, parks, and major sites.